Do you think, Russell, that there's anything travelers often overlook that can land them in trouble? So, yeah, I, I think in some cases, not being familiar with local customs, norms, or laws doesn't apply everywhere you go, but some places, certain parts of Africa, Southeast Asia, and also uh, going to the Middle East, and two things with that. Well, one is we can possibly explain is just inadvertently offend someone, just just the basic things that we do at home. And for that, if, if my suggestion with that is if ever uh, I were to inadvertently offend someone, there's something I recommend, the triple A, which is the first A is to acknowledge the offended person, uh, what it is that they're upset about. The second A is to apologize. And the third one is to act or take action to de-escalate the situation. Now, the thing is, that won't necessarily help you if you've inadvertently broken a law or quite often they'll claim that ignorance is no excuse. So in those sorts of cases, it just is important to do some research. And some things as simple as if you go to Singapore for the first time, a lot of the things that we do uh, here as tourists, like jaywalking, smoking outside, uh, Perhaps if you, if you were to spit while walking down the street, a lot of these things are punishable offenses, even, even not, uh, not flushing a public toilet. Now, I, I'm not sure how they would get you, unless there's a police officer standing in line behind you, perhaps. But, uh, but a lot of things you, you just wouldn't imagine. So, so it is very important to be informed of those sorts of things, uh, uh, depending on where you're traveling to the world. Yeah, I love that. I'm going to have to remember this triple A.